Hey guys, welcome to our channel, Chill on You Too. Nowadays, you will not surprise people with the word nanotechnology, yet many people don't even realize the great impact nanotechnology has on our daily lives. Nanotechnology is a new field of science and engineering that focuses on studying and making very, 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 very small things. Nanotechnologies are devices and materials that are less than 100 nanometers in size. That's about the size of a virus or so they say. Right now, most of the nanotechnologies you come across are incorporated into existing products, making them better. For example, nanotechnology makes computer chips smaller and faster, and golf clubs stronger and lighter. But future nanotechnologies will address issues of global importance, such as energy, medicine, water, and food. Here are the top five nanotechnologies that impact our life. So, Without further ado, let's dive in. You guys will be shocked to see the third invention on the list. Number 5. DNA Synthetic Nanopore Scientists use DNA origami to create a synthetic 9 nanometer wide DNA nanopore controlled by programmable lipidated flaps and equipped with a size selective gating system for the translocation of macromolecules. Nanopore sequencing is a one-of-a-kind, adaptable innovation that empowers immediate, real-time analysis of long DNA or RNA fragments. It works by checking changes to electrical current as nucleic acid are gone through a protein nanopore. The following sign is decoded to give the particular DNA or RNA sequence. Scientists have been continually trying to extend this principle and build larger pores to accommodate proteins for sensing purposes. Still, a significant challenge has been the limited understanding of artificial protein design. As an alternative, the DNA origami technique was invented. DNA origami is one of the most recent techniques of utilizing DNA as building blocks for the synthesis of nanoparticles. In addition to that, the pore is composed of a set of controllable flaps that allows targeted insertion into membranes displaying particular signal molecules. According to scientists, this synthetic nanopore will enable the insertion of the sensor specifically into diseased cells and may allow diagnosis at the single cell level. Number 4. Nanomedicine Nowhere is the application of nanotechnology more exciting than in the biomedical field, where advances are being made in both diagnostics and treatment areas. Houston-based Nanospectra Biosciences has been developing a new therapy using a combination of gold nanoshells and lasers to destroy cancer tumors with heat. Based on work done by Rice University professors Dr. Naomi Hallis and Dr. Jennifer West, the technology promises to destroy tumors with minimal damage to adjacent healthy tissue. In the diagnostic area, nanosensors can detect, identify, and quantify biological substances in body fluids which lead to early disease detection and early treatments as well as the ability to detect environmental contaminants in the body. John Stroh, the Nanospectra CEO, says he is hoping for European approval in the second or third quarter of this year and FDA approval early next year after 10 years of ongoing development and testing. Number 3. Magnetic Helical Like a shoal of miniature corkscrews, the mothbots are coming. Spurred along by magnetic fields, these helical swimmers are the latest steps towards building microscopic vehicles that carry therapeutic drugs to precisely where they're needed in living tissue. The swimmers unite to well-developed technologies. Researchers have already created a range of torpedo-like nanorobots or micro-robots that are propelled by chemical fuels, such as a stream of oxygen bubbles produced as the bot breaks down hydrogen peroxide. Other bots look like motorized versions of noodle pasta, with a helical shape that can be steered around by a rotating magnetic field. Meanwhile, Metal Organic Frameworks MOFs are showing promise as drug delivery systems. These crystalline lattices, made from metal-based nodes connected by organic struts, are extremely porous and can be loaded with medicines. But it has been proved difficult to move MOFs around in a controlled way. 
They coated the heliuses with nickel to make them magnetic and titanium to make them biocompatible. Number 2. Nanotechnology in Water and Air Treatment Nanotechnology is playing an important role in a range of environmental and health applications, including air and water treatment. For example, U.S. researchers have developed a drinkable book that uses pages full of silver nanoparticles to filter contaminated water. According to Scientific American, the book can filter up to 100 liters of drinking water. In addition, nanotechnology is being used to improve air quality. Researchers at MIT have found another use for silk and its nanofibrils in the filtration systems. While ABB uses nanotechnology for air filtration to efficiently block dust, nanotechnology applications for air treatment may also prove helpful in the fighting against COVID-19. In Israel, researchers at Ben Gurion University of Nijab are developing a new type of air filter that can self-sterilize while decontaminating the air. This air filtration system is based on laser-induced graphene filters that remove viruses and bacteria. Number 1. Miskin's Robots Over the course of the past several years, Miskin's and his research colleagues developed a multi-step non-fabrication technique that turns a 4-inch specialized silicon wafer into a million microscopic robots in just weeks. Each is 70 microns long, about the width of a very thin human hair. The robot's bodies are formed from a super thin rectangular skeleton of glass topped with a thin layer of silicon into which the researchers etch its electronic control components and either two or four silicon solar cells. Each of a robot's four legs is formed from a bilayer of platinum and titanium, or alternatively, graphene. The platinum is applied using atomic layer deposition. It's like painting with atoms. The platinum titanium layer is then cut into each robot's four 100 atom thick legs. The legs are super strong. Each robot carries a body that's 1,000 times thicker and weighs roughly 8,000 times more than each leg. The researchers shine a laser on one of the robot's solar cells to power it. Miskins is thinking about new energy sources, including ultrasound and magnetic fields that would enable these robots to make incredible journeys in the human body for missions such as drug delivery or mapping the brain. All right, y'all, that's the end of this video, the top five advanced nanotech inventions that will change the world. We hope you really enjoyed it. Thanks for tuning in. But before you go, subscribe, like, comment below, and don't forget, hit that bell icon to check out more interesting videos made just for you.